Hey agents, today I am going to be showing you how to add somebody as an admin or an administrator on your Facebook business page. Uh, this is helpful, especially if you are hiring somebody or bringing somebody on that's going to run your social media or do updates or if you just want to give access to those people. So it's going to be pretty short and simple. Let's get to it. Hey guys, and as always, if you find any of this information helpful, definitely uh, hit that like button, subscribe, hit the bell notification if you wanna get more videos like this. It helps uh, more than you can realize in spreading the joy of my channel. But like I said, it's a pretty simple, straightforward how to add an admin. And uh, one big bonus tip of why you should add an admin, uh, even create a fake account, and put that admin in charge. I will tell you why at the end of this video. So let's get to this short tutorial right away. So first thing you wanna do is bring up your Facebook business page and then on the top right, keep in mind Facebook constantly changes things so you might have to uh, look a little extra once in a while to find something but generally it's the same steps. You just might have to look a little harder sometimes. But currently uh, you just hit settings and then you go to the left side here on the left column it says page roles click that and then it says assign a new page role and you have these options admin editor moderator all that etc cetera, etc cetera. Um, it'll give you an explanation of what they can do so if you want somebody that can just edit or if you want somebody that's totally in charge uh, <clears throat> that's what I suggest you make the fake account for. If you are the only person that's going to be in charge, make the second one. But you just type in their name. Uh, and then you click it. And you select what they're going to be. And then you add it. And then they'll get a notification on their Facebook that uh, you have requested them to be an admin, editor, whatever it is on that page and they just have to accept and they have all the ability. It's that simple. That was pretty short and simple, right? Well, the reason you should have another person on your account as an admin, even if you create a fake account or uh, maybe your wife or your mom or somebody, just to give, put them on the admin is in case your Facebook account gets deleted somehow. But believe me, it can happen as happened to me and other people I've known. So it's just a way for you to protect your business accounts uh, your personal one might disappear, but if you have somebody else as an admin, your business accounts will stay, continue to be viable. For uh, when my account was, my personal account was deleted, my business accounts were inaccessible and disappeared. I had one that I had an admin on, another admin on, and that was the only one that survived and stayed and, is access and was accessible. Ac accessible? So that's it. Uh, let me know if you learned anything. Comment below and hit that like button if you haven't yet. I appreciate it. And as always, I'm Agent KCG and this is my Realty Reality. I hope this helped you, Kelly.